Ooh, hello. Just gonna reshuffle. Oh, oh. Ah, sorry, I should really be more prepared. Hello everyone and welcome back. We're in the pink bubble chair, which is really quite a fun place to be. But I'm very, very excited for today's video because I'm pretty sure the weather where we are isn't supposed to be this nice this weekend. But next week is a scorcher and my plans for next week are to be out enjoying the sunshine. Um, obviously social distancing and all that malarkey, but... That is why today's video is a swimwear haul with Fashion Nova. So these items have been very kindly gifted to me by Fashion Nova. I'm so blooming excited. I'm just gonna, I mean, I have basically so much swimwear, it's a bit of a sick joke, um, but you guys know I'm absolutely obsessed with Fashion Nova. They have some of the best swimwear, really good quality, I'd highly recommend. Um, I'm actually currently wearing this little top oh, sorry i'm really not very good at this this little top um which is actually swimwear this is a bikini top but i thought it was kind of top like so i'd wear it for the sitting down sectioni of this video i know that i would normally just try on things as i go but i feel like with swimwear it's a little bit more difficult because i don't want to accidentally flash something i shouldn't and all that malarkey so i just thought i would talk through every single piece and then we will try it on in the next clip oh ow oh i just had a hand spasm oh ah that was weird never had that before anyway so i'm gonna start showing you guys i'll start with the bottoms of this top um and i got all of them in a size small um just for reference and um this top when it was off i thought it looked a bit big but it's actually not and it's got these really cute little details at the side which obviously you can tighten or loosen depending on how you want it and then these are the bottoms so they are a nice high-waisted nude bottom they've got quite like a thin string at the side um but i'm hoping these look really nice on i just i really like the nude um i didn't think i would like nude on because i don't know like nude swimwear i don't i don't really think of any nude swimwear that i've seen that i'm like oh but i just thought this was really nice and obviously it's a really great piece that goes with absolutely everything and obviously you could get this set and then just wear this as a top with like denim shorts in the sunshine it's an option now these bottoms are rather minuscule i'm not gonna lie to you and um, they aren't the biggest about but they're actually really freaking cute and also i feel like the nude straps are kind of blending into my skin um that is what the back is looking like again it's quite a petite bottom but they are very stretchy um which is great and then you can see all the details of this little top up close and um, it's also got really good lining so i feel like with nude you'd be concerned that it'd go a little bit see-through but i really don't think that would be a concern um and yeah it's very cute it's very comfortable as well like very comfortable i feel like with bigger bikini tops i almost normally feel like they are like really restrictive and stuff like that but it's not and i could jump around and like i don't feel restricted and my boobs don't feel like they're gonna fall out freaking cute amazing okay let's go for a very different vibe next let's go for a slightly more technically typical misha look okay sorry this i'm gonna move where the bikinis are because currently i'm having to spin away from you guys and you hi so i'm just here to say Please don't judge me for the state of my hair extensions when I turn to the side. It's been a long lockdown, but they're coming out. They are coming out. Don't you worry. You just want to see my face, don't you? You probably really don't. Okay, the next one gives me Misha at WikiWoo vibes. Now, if you don't know WikiWoo, WikiWoo is the hotel that me and Chloe now stay at in Ibiza. Um, obviously, we were planned to go in September, but, you know, things are most probably not going to be happening um which is okay you know there's more important things in the world than misha and chloe going to ibiza we could always go next year um but anyway so for me this is a wiki woo bikini because i had those nails you remember i had like the pink and the neon green nails that were striped and i had them done before we went and then coincidentally we realized whilst i was out there that my nails matched the hotel Honestly, I don't know how I managed it, but basically anyone that we met at the hotel was like, oh my god, your nails match, did you plan that? I was like, no, 
but this is kind of that vibe um so it's a black a black a white and neon green slash neon yellow i'd say that's neon green but maybe i'm wrong maybe it's neon yellow i'd say green maybe yellow mm, maybe yellow yellow um bikini top and it's just really freaking cute it's just got a triangle bikini which you know triangle bikinis are my absolute favorite because i think they're the most flattering and then the bottoms are a little bit more coverage um which i think is really nice but i'm obsessed with this shape like this is my favorite shape of swimwear bottom um which is very different to what i used to like uh me and mom were laughing back at like all these old photos where everything i used to wear was really low waisted and i hated high waisted and now i absolutely hate low waisted to be fair mum still has a pair of low waisted jeans which she wore the other day and i was like oh my god mum they're so low waisted and she was like oh my god they are i didn't even realize but you know just work with what you like, you like and you know go for what you think suits you um don't let anybody else tell you what suits you you know if you feel comfortable in something and you prefer something to something else then you know go with it but no really really like these they also think did this in like a bright pink um but i thought that the like neony yellowy green was a slightly different look okay this is just the cutest bikini also i'm realizing that i say okay at the beginning of every single one i'm really sorry about that but love 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 like if you could like put me in a bikini you know this is the kind of thing that i would think of um because it's a triangle it's such a nice flattering shape for the bottoms it's a Misha kind of butt. It's bright. It's just so freaking cute and so comfortable. And I don't feel like I'm getting a wedgie, which is great because you don't want that. Um, and it's just, it's just a beaut piece. I absolutely love it. And also, I do have scrunchies to match. Uh, not quite in the right shade. Maybe. No. Hmm. That one maybe. To be fair, if it's up there, you probably wouldn't tell that much. But, so freaking cute. I absolutely love it. I don't know if you can see the pattern. Oh, there we go. You can see the pattern a little bit better there. Um, because it is kind of getting, like, blanked out by the ring light because it's against the white. But I also wonder if in the dark, this would light up? Maybe. We'll find out. I don't know when, but I'll let you know. Um, then, okay. Another one of Misha's favourite ever colours is lilac. We love lilac, we do. I love lilac, how about you? Okay, so a new bikini top style that I've actually been introduced to in the past like year or so that I'm actually a big fan of is kind of like a cupped one, but not like a cupped as in like a normal cupped, as in like an underwire situation i don't know if you can see that's kind of the accurate color sorry the sun is in a really weird place right now um so i just thought this was very very pretty i think these are very very flattering on your boobs this literally has zero padding like there is not an ounce of padding there is just literally the bikini top so i'm intrigued what my boobies will look like in it but loved the color thought the shape was nice and then the bottoms I do love a string bikini bottom. This was like my old favourite. Um, after the low rise came the string ties. And now it's like the curved one that I like. But I still do really like these because they're just useful in the respect of say that you are a small on the bottom but a medium on the no a small on the top but a medium on the bottom you can order the set in a small um to be fair i'm probably a small up and down i don't really know you know me i'm, I'm crap with sizing um but the strings give you the ability to you know buy the set in a small and the small bottoms still fit your medium bottom half if you know what i mean because you can loosen the strings and tie them to the length that you want so i just think you know if you're in between sizes and say they only do the bikini as a set this kind of bottom is a great shout okay so when i said these bikini tops gave you boobs wasn't quite expecting this much of a boob so it is quite like a small top like there's not much to it at the side it's quite center heavy so it's definitely giving me the boobs i've definitely got a lot of boobage going on um and then the bikini bottom is just the go-to it is quite low at the front you know this is quite a revealing bikini but i think because of the color it makes it a little bit more cute okay let's go for something maybe something a little bit sexier you know a little bit of sex appeal you know i don't do it very often but sometimes so let's start with the bottoms they are just a classic red v high-waisted 
pretty thong at the back like they are pretty up there if you know what i mean um but the reason i picked up this is it's actually kind of like a one piece but it's a two piece if you know what i mean but you know it's it's a more than just a bikini top so this is the most beautiful red one shoulder long sleeves like hooped at the side bikini top now this to me would be perfect in ibiza marbella your garden you know it's one of those pieces that i just think has all the sexy vibes um i'm very intrigued what it's going to look like i don't know if there's going to be under boob or what's going to be going on um but it's called the on the vibe two-piece bikini on the vibe i'm vibing we're vibing oh and by the way all of the you know as normal they all come with the little stickers over the phalange and yes i know phalange is technically fingers but i have renamed phalanges to be your phalanges you're down not the here the down you know what i mean okay so this one is i mean i freaking love it um it's definitely more of a bikini than i realized for some reason on the website i thought it was more of a swimsuit but it's definitely not so it is quite small around the bosom area i'm not gonna lie to you like this side doesn't have that much space for big boobs um so obviously you know pick the size accordingly also i feel like i need a little bit that's a bit too much under boob um so one shoulder kind of makes me think of like a leotard or like i'm on dancing on ice all of that jazz um and then we've got some nice red high-waisted bottoms as i said i do think this was more um one piece than it is I don't know why I just have it in my head, but I freaking love it. I think this is so cool. I just, I love a like one sided, one shoulder thing. I think it makes a really nice illusion and shape on the body. Um, so no, 10 out of 10. The red is also really nice. And again, although it's got the arm piece, I don't feel like I've got some tight restricted arm that like can't move. Um, so no obsessed with this yes i mean it'd give you some interesting tan lines but that's besides the point anyway so let's go to something a bit more cute okay this top looks a bit big so i don't know how this is gonna fit on my boobies um but i might be pleasantly surprised so again it's like a triangle but like a slightly different triangle um and also if you do have smaller boobs and you don't want and you kind of want to make it have an illusion of you having bigger boobs i would recommend frilled tops and you can see it's got this big old frill because it kind of distracts from where the cleavage would be and i think they're really really flattering it does have adjustable straps at the back um, and then a tie back um but you know if you have a bikini top that is attached at the back it's great when they do have these adjustable bits um because you know we all like a different level of support we all have a different like size and length in between like our nips and our chest bones or like our waist and our boobs and our you know what i mean like every single person is completely different so it's good when they do have those features because it just kind of makes it more wearable for everyone and then these bottoms okay if you are someone that is not the biggest fan of say like you know when like a swimsuit like cuts into you i know it is the trend i get that and i'm getting more into it because it's like oh you've got curves and there's like bikini is like cutting at your sides and you're looking all snatched it's what we're going for but something like this is really great if you know you're not fully there yet um because this little ruffle is so complimentary on the body um and you know if not that there's anything wrong with hip dips we all have them but i know that you know not necessarily and you know i'm not saying the problem is that i'm not saying that you need to get rid of these things or you know you need to you know we can't get rid of hip dips we've, we've probably all got them and you know we're working with them but if it's something that you do personally feel a little bit more self-conscious about then you know you could go for a bottom like this and then you'll feel more confident and you know slowly but surely you'll then move on to something that's a little bit less covered up you know what i mean like you can't expect to um one day feel really unconfident and then the next day be walking around in like something that for you shows all the parts of yourself that you necessarily don't 100% want to like you know like you know what i mean let's like, shout that from the rooftops um so i just think it's like a slow journey so if you are on like a body 
confident body positivity journey like don't think there's a start and an end and you want to get there as quick as possible because that doesn't happen there is no end as well um and you know it's all just part of the journey and sorry i'm getting very deep but i feel like it's um a relevant topic because obviously i am just doing swimwear in this haul if that's not your kind of thing then that is totally fine but for me i don't see a problem with showing things like swimwear and underwear on my channel because this is something that you know we all wear we all need and um we shouldn't be ashamed to cover up our bodies and things like that you know like it's our bodies we can do with it what we want and i want to be the person that you know comes on here and shows you guys what these pieces look like on someone that isn't so bootylicious and isn't so curvaceous and i don't typically have like a womanly figure per se you know like i've got a, a little bit of an indent around my waist and I've, I've got a bit of a butt like i've got a bit of a fat butt but you know i don't have these big voluptuous boobies and this little hourglass um, figure which so many of the incredible girls on Fashion Nova and they look amazing but I think it's quite nice for you guys to see a different side and these pieces on a different body type um, so that is why I do what I do um, each to their own and everything like that but that's just my little two pence okay so sadly as I guessed this bikini top is just too big for me it doesn't look bad it just for me i think looks out of proportion because i'm not used to having such a big cup obviously i could remove the cups and see to be fair that is a lot better when i remove let's remove the other one i think this is i think this is the changer of the game better better it's still a little bit big but you know one little stitch and that would be better oh oh but this is the little pink number. Now it looks like I'm wearing a little tutu, which I'm so here for because I think it's so cute. But can you see that it kind of creates a little bit more of like an hourglass shape because it has that little like rouging flyaway detail. Um, but no, so cute. Love the little string at the back. It's just like a normal thong style back so sweet the pink color is really really cute i would just maybe if you're in between sizes size down because this top definitely does come up a little bit big um but nothing i can't like fix with a little bit of stitching or some actual proper padding to like make my boobs go like that because you know sometimes we want cleavage you know occasionally misha's here for cleavage um but no really really cute and slightly more covered up i would say I think this is like a 6 out of 10 on the covered up scale, scale, but then most of my bikinis are like a 2 out of 10. Whoopsies. Um, one piece that I'm pretty sure is just not going to work on Misha's boobies, which is really annoying, is this beautiful like Versace print bikini. Um, it is like a padded top, so I might be surprised, but I just think that that looks very big for me. Um... But this is typically not a bikini top shape that I would go for because personally I'm not necessarily a fan of it on my body. But I might be surprised. I really, really don't know. Um, I love the pattern. I love the colouring. Um, and then these are the bottoms. So it is a slightly more covered up, you know, like a little bit more demure bikini. Um, I kind of think of, I think of wearing this in Miami in like the Versace mansion. Um, I don't know why, but that's just kind of the vibes that it gives me. So no, absolutely beautiful. We will see when it's on what I think about it. Well, this one is definitely a dark horse of the competition. So obviously I expected this top to be really big for me. And like, yeah, it is a little bit big, um, but it's honestly not, bad personally i wouldn't normally go for a style like this this is very much the kind of bikini top that i used to wear when i was like 15 because i really wanted to create this like boob shape but now i prefer a triangle but i actually still do like this so yeah i definitely say it's a dark horse but you guys are gonna have to let me know what you think the bottoms are a lot more covered up than i'm used to but that's really not a bad thing um so it is cute i wasn't expecting to like it Ooh. then one that i'm so excited to blinking try on this has similar bottoms to the pink frilled one in the respect of those little details it's slightly more covered up on the bottom this might not be covered up for you guys but for me it's covered up when i walk out with walk around with my bum cheeks hanging out half the time um and then this top i am in love with i'm in love with this kind of like it's like a tie-dye but not really a tie-dye pattern um now you're not gonna be able to see this until i put it on right now this looks like some weird like jock strap or like body attachment thing Honestly, I don't know why. 
um, but it is basically a triangle bikini shape and then it's got a slightly more strappage which is great support if you do have bigger boobs then it has the frill at the bottom which is so cute and then it has the little center tie so you can tighten it and loosen it so freaking adorable i'm obsessed with blue at the moment i think it's such an underrated color and i've said that so many times in my video so i'm trying to prove that by wearing it a bit more um but no i think this is so pretty so cute and you know you can have sexy swimwear you can have cute swimwear you can have swimwear for every single occasion and whatever mood you are in well isn't this the cutest little thing okay so here is this little blue number annoyingly the top is a little bit big for me but i think if i just got mum to sew that down a little bit then that would be perfect it's just where my shoulders are like not fully filling it well actually no it's my boobs that aren't fully filling it but you know it's fine it's so adorable obviously you can adjust this bit and like that bit and then sort out all the little ruffles i love the little ruffle on the bikini bottoms i just think this kind of looks like almost i wish they did like a kid's one not that i have a kid but you know what i mean like if i had a little daughter or a little son in like matching swim shorts or like a little daughter in a matching swimming costume oh it would just look so cute because it kind of gives me like young vibes but in a really like cutesy you know swimwear-y way so no love this little pattern love all the ruffles it's a winner from me um and then the back is just like so and then it's kind of like a little bit more you know supportive i do think this is obviously a top that is made for people with slightly i mean when did i ever mention siri anyway let's go now we might as well show you another more original piece now i'm assuming that this is um not one that i would personally wear in the water but each to their own this is the kind of one that i would again wear in ibiza i know we keep on going on about it but i'm just a bit sad but it's fine no i'm, I'm kidding around it's okay um and this is it they did the they did this in a few different colors but it's basically a crochet bikini top that has all these tassels on it now if i had a cowboy hat i would be giving myself all the old town road um feels i'm gonna take my horse to maybe i'll save that for when i put it on and i'll sing it to you guys um and then these are the bottoms again they are a string tie i would say that crochet swimwear does come up a little bit larger because you know it is in a fabric that's like I don't know, it's stretchy, but it's a bit more of a looser fabric. So maybe size down um, into something like this, but we'll see when I try it on. And I know they had it in like a white and a pink, I think. Well, this is freaking adorable. Okay, I feel like I'm kind of in like some tassely little, I don't even know what. Um, I need to actually tighten this side of the bikini bottom. But this is such a beautiful set. It kind of looks like I'm wearing a little mini skirt. Like I've got, oh God, I just did it looser, sorry. Don't mind me, I've got butter fingers. Um, but no, it's kind of like it's got a little mini skirt at the front, which I think is so cute. Alfie's just coming out from a bath, so if we get a crazy dog running in. Oh, oh, he's gone straight out. No? Yes? Okay. Um, also, obviously, you have the tassels down the chest. I think this is so freaking cute. Um, I actually don't agree with myself about sizing down. I would say stick with your size. And you said, where am I going? To the garden. Let's go. Arriba. <laughs> I believe in dream. Oh my God, no, I was going to sing Old Town Road. I got the horses in the back. Horse is in tech. Manny bada bag and a horse bada bag. Ain't nobody tell me nothing. They can't tell me nothing. Okay, yeah, and then the back is a slightly more covered up ish situation. Uh, then another wiki woo kind of mems bikini is this one now This is a very itty bitty bikini. This is the smallest bikini that we've seen um, I'm intrigued what this is gonna look like, uh, but let me just untie all these strings Don't mind me. Here we go. Okay when it first arrived. I was like is this is this just the top? But then I realized. So this is the bikini top. Now again, I got this in a size small. So this looks a bit itty bitty for you. Maybe just size up. But for me, honestly, I know this sounds ridiculous and it kind of looks like a four year old's top. 
I freaking love tiny bikini tops because A, they make your boobs look bigger, B, they give you really good tan lines because they're so small, and C, they're just freaking adorable. So this is another like neony green number, and then these are the bottoms now. These bottoms are Okay, I have absolutely no freaking idea what these are going to look like on, but I'm very intrigued. Like, I don't know that's going to cover my womanhood, but we're going to see. Um, we're going to see. That's all I can say. Okay, pre-warning. If you don't like itty bitty little bitty bitty bikinis, this might not be for you. Definitely not a family holiday kind of bikini. Then again, I did just go downstairs and show my entire family this, but I do have a bit of a weird family. So, it's quite a small one. Yes, it's quite an itty bitty one. Um, I personally think this would be amazing because you'd have such good tan lines. Um, it is a little bit under booby, but it's okay. It's fine, we're working with it. Oh God, I thought I just saw something move behind me. I think it was just my watch strap. Um, obviously the bottoms you can like pull to wherever you fancy. Um, the bottoms are actually more covered than I thought they'd be, but it's still not covered. And then my mother has told me that I'm not allowed to show the back, but um, that gives you a, a little insight into what the back is like, uh, but really comfy. Actually still feels very secure on my boobs, even though there's not a, a mirror roller, even though there's not a lot of fabric there. I love the color combo. It's not an everyone kind of bikini, but for me, the right occasion when I want to get a tan, it's a bit of me, basically. Okay, the last two I have are actually a black and a white one. I'm going to go with the white one first because this is just a classic bikini. Um, it's just a plain white side tie. Little ruffle up the bum cheek, which is great, you know. We might as well get all the... Can you see that? Cinching that is there. And then it has a little ruffle on the front. Just this little added detail. And then a go-to triangle bikini top. You can see that although I've gone for a lot of triangle bikini tops, they all look so different. So don't think just because you personally prefer one style of swimwear on you that you can't get totally different, like, unique looks. Um, so this is very, you know, I kind of think of, like, American vibes, you know, chillaxing. I don't know why, but I do. How freaking cute is this little bikini top? Now, this is the first triangle top that actually has a bit of padding. Um, so it does give a little bit more of a bosom. And then we have bikini bottoms. They're definitely a lot more mini than I thought they were going to be. But no problem over here. Um, the back is just, you know, you'll go to tie. Just a very, like, cute bikini. I can see there's, like, a little shirt, like a checkered shirt around the waist and some denim shorts. You know, it's just a classic to have. Um, very useful. And also, I think white looks so nice with a tan. So freaking nice. And again, obviously, adjustable strings so you can do with it whatever you fancy. And then this last one is one that they have in a few different colours, but it kept on coming in and out of stock and I never managed to pick it up. And then when I saw it came back into stock, I was absolutely freaking buzzing. So this is like a party bikini for me. Like this is your go-to party bikini. It's a black triangle bikini. Well done. I wonder who would have guessed that. And can you see that it's got this beautiful gold chaining detail and then the black straps because it all kind of is in the bum the, the, the whole thing is in is in the pants basically so this is the bikini bottoms which is the front and which is back that way so can you see that it basically on this side it's got the normal black bikini bottom bit and then on this side they've replaced it with this gold chain which I freaking love. It's high rise, it's got a mini little scrunchy bit at the back, it's very bummy I'm sure but I am obsessed with this and hopefully it will look really really nice. I'm praying. Well this one's got me feeling like a little bit of a belly dancer. Okay so these bottoms are actually more like covered up here than I'm used to so it's a bit strange for me because I'm not used to this kind of shape um but I love this little detail here with the gold I absolutely love the details here obviously if you didn't want to wear such like a revealing um side like cheeky bottom all the time with this you could just wear a black bikini 
bottom if you wanted like a more plain but you still wanted the gold at the top or you could do it the other way around and do like a different black top there's many an option um but it's definitely a different style of bikini bottom for me which is really interesting because you know push yourself outside your comfort zone try something new um it's just like a normal string but it does have very long strings so i feel like i could almost bloom in i mean this probably won't look very good but it doesn't really go but you know what i mean we get the gist oh, oh wow okay oh I mean, that looks, that is something. <laughs> Who knows? I'm getting a bit too creative. But no, really, really lovely quality. Um, the metal also feels stupidly secure, which is obviously reassuring because we don't want any spillages, pretty much. Uh, but yeah, that is all the swimwear that I picked up from Fashion Nova. There are so many fab pieces. I'm obsessed with all of them. I cannot wait to wear them, whether it be in my garden or, you know, in a random field um, on a dog walk when it's really, really warm. But, you know, it's just it's just a bit of fun. Um, you know, swimwear is also something that I don't think really goes out of style. So like this white piece, that will never be out of style. And it's a classic to have in your collection. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. I will link all the pieces down below. And yeah, toodle pip. I love you guys lots. And I'll see you in the next one. Happy Super Bowl Sunday. And toodle pip. Bye. Mm -hmm. Love you guys.